this is Ranger Buchanan. When I usually go to the beach, I crave for clam cakes and chowder. But the Duke of Windsor, he craves burgers. Here's the connection from Burrowville to the Bahamas, all for a burger. You see, in 1915, Austin T. Levy and his wife June first traveled to the Bahama Islands, the island of Eleuthera, where there he could see the possibilities of farming, of setting up an area to provide a whole new economic growth on the island and in new resources. His experimental farming changed the living conditions and standards of the island's economy. In 1936, after years of careful study and planning, Levy purchased his first Bahama Holdings, a 2,000-acre tract on Hatchet Bay. From the start grew the enterprise that made the Harrisville manufacturer a pioneer in the island's economic growth. Levy first introduced modern machinery that was used to improve the island's scanty soil, then followed dairy herds sent from Harrisville's own Sherman Stock Farm, and later his flocks of Rhode Island red hens followed. While establishing the plantation, he met the Duke of Windsor, then governor of the Bahama Islands. The Duke expressed his love of eating burgers, and thus the Burville Burger Connection was born. Levy invited him to visit Burville, which the Duke did in 1944. The Duke toured the Stillwater Mill, the assembly and local site that Levy had built for his beloved hometown. Levy's project was a catalyst, leading to change in the island from a struggling colony dependent upon tourists to a thriving zone of largely self-supporting residents. All this was made possible by Austin T. Levy 